I'm currently I don't need this, right? Now, I, one of the things that I hate about coding tutorials in general is that they are slow. And today, if you're coding in any kind of like way with AI, you copy and paste a lot and then you evaluate a lot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this function over here where I'm going to have to tweak very little things to then um, allow us to get what we want. So you can see over here the function and then we will have to call it. So it's not summarized page, but it's base chat. Okay, base chat takes a string, which is question, and then this question over here, I'm going to pass it across to this prompt, and we're going to leave it as it is right now. I'll explain this in a second. First thing that we need to do is we need to come down here, and we need to add, you add python dash dot n. Oh, sorry. Now, what's what's happening? The first thing that we do is we import the library of Grok. I need a virtual environment because to use Grok, I'm going to have to use uh, a, a key. And for that, I'm going to add this dot m. And something that I want you to uh, pay attention to is that we should have had a file over here called in the initialization. So there we go. Now everything looks like a normal git re repo. And I'm going to put over here dot env and dot vm. When I save this, you see that these two have gone gray. That's because now they are ignored by the git. So that means that my uh, source control, where essentially I keep all of the code, don't need to take these things in. Now, I'm going to add over here in this dot m something called rock API key. Now, this is going to be blurred simply because it's my private key. And obviously, this, uh, this is the secret that you need to um, <laughs> be careful not to leak 